Hi guys, so this will be a very short clip of me sitting in my living room because most of it oh, I'm sweating as you can see, most of it uh, I filmed in the car so I only got a couple of pieces to show you here this is actually from the last day of um, drifting Friday and I uh, went to the bins, I got this half of a small soldiers figure it's missing two well, an arm and a leg, of course. And uh, here it's also, I think, some part missing. It has an action feature. It's a shame who takes out his arms. I think it's uh, maybe it's the... Because this one isn't going out that easily. But actually, if you look on eBay, it's pretty expensive figure once complete. Also found nothing amazing. Uh, not a Skylander. It's in Disney Infinity. Captain America, a troll to put on my pencil. I love trolls. And this one I showed you already in, well, I will show you. This one I bought, you will see it in the video, but I could have almost completed this guy from this one I bought already months ago. The second missile I found last week, I think. I found the figure this week. Um, yeah, it's a pretty cool figure actually. It's only miss missing the visor here, which is a shame because otherwise it would be complete. Not that these Batman Kenner figures are really super inexpensive. You can buy this mint on card for like 15 euros on eBay. Uh, I also found the weapons to this uh, Robin, which I also picked up several weeks ago already. But now it's a complete figure. Whip! Yay! And yeah, oh yeah, the zombie guy. <laughs> I don't know what this is from, but I liked him. It's like a plastic um, zombie guy that you can... I'm gonna hang him somewhere in my car. And that's about it. All the rest will be shown in the clips following. So enjoy those clips and see you guys next week. Bye. Okay guys, just did the bins. Not a whole lot of stuff. Got this... Um, Batman motorcycle from 1996 looking pretty cool uh -oh. I don't know what just fell off there something I don't know no that's not uh, that was just some sort of pearl and whoa as you can see shooting X and still works it's uh, dirty but it's complete I'm assuming I also got this Batman door, don't know which set this is from. I do have the Wayne Manor, maybe that's part of it, I don't know. This gal from uh, the animated Ronald McDonald figures. Uh, I think this is Batman, not sure, I just took it. <laughs> got this other leg last week, still don't know what it's from, but it looks like a cool vintage leg. Uh, I'm gonna just whoop, empty it all on my uh, my lap here. Uh, <clears throat> half a Joe. <laughs> These I always find half a Joe. Sometimes I find them complete. Pretty cool trans Lego piece. Uh, it's from the classic space series, of course. This is from Batman the Riddler. I actually have this backpack backpack with one missile, so now I have both missiles. No, I only need the figure from the Riddler. Playmobil horse headpiece. Lego. I like these uh, early 90s badges, smileys. Those were the, the, the bomb back then. Lego Technics piece, Lego piece, Lego piece. And these are all, I don't know, pieces. It's uh, if somebody knows, please let me know. Missile with a skull on its face, pretty sweet. Some sort of shotgun, an axe marked made in China, like a double sworded hand axe. <sighs> no idea if it's a gun or <laughs> what the hell it is. And this somehow seemed familiar to me i think isn't it like from the turtles like a a, a shoulder patch i'm not 100 sure and then this weird metal piece 
I don't know what it's from, but some sort of toy. I'm gonna heat up two more thrift stores and then gonna head home, so wish me luck, guys. Hmm. Two bucks sticking anyway. Bad girl, Pokemon, cool batch. Hey guys, so as you saw, I picked up that uh, Zelda game, Twilight Princess. The disc is pretty scratched, but I think it will be alright. I mean, it's okay like this. It was also very dusty. The other games I didn't mess with. Uh, from the action figures, I took the Riddler. I hope it's actually the Riddler from the Rocket that I just bought. Well, you saw it five seconds ago, so you'll remember. I'm not sure because it looks like he's supposed to be sitting on a moped or something. We'll see. This is a more modern Joker. I don't know which year it is. Probably from the recent movie. Uh, cool Pokemon. And a Ronald McDonald. Also, I think from the same series that I found that the girl figure now. Um, two Star Wars blokes. I think these are Power of the Force ones. Well, I'm pretty sure because they're 90.95. So, yeah, pretty nice. Toys are all 20 cents a piece, the game was 2 euros a piece. And then two more comic books in the series Modern. This is a pretty old series, but I like to collect them if I see them. They're always cool stories. So yeah, on to the next store. So as you could see in that little clip, I found a huge stack of video games, nothing really great. But I did pick up some stuff. Blitz the League 2, I think this is the last Blitz game. I got the first one on 360. And this I is actually a, a PlayStation game I never heard of. Viva Football. Uh, on eBay it's 10 euros so for 2 euros I picked it up looks kind of interesting like a virgin developed football game don't think it sold too well back in the day and then I picked up another copy of uh, yeah, Air Combat um, yeah just because these come in these weird cases and I have some of these that are completely destroyed so this will be a donor game sad but true one more store and then we're through so guys I went to a thrift store in Dernan again because last week they had those great 
360 games but they all mingled up the discs and I just wasn't willing to wait there so all the games were still there and today they had to ride discs in them there here it's pretty expensive they're asking 350 a piece most other thrift stores ask two two euros for a game so this one I picked up because I think the cover looks really cool and it's a Koei game so I don't know maybe it's good and this one is also a Koei game Blade Storm the Hundred Years War and lastly this one's up for trade I know it's a pretty decent title I have it myself and it was also 350 so I think that's okay so if anybody wants this for trade let me know and then last but not least the barbed wire official comic of the movie this is the UK uh, version but I like that it means it has a nice cover and everything with some shots from the movie probably a horrible comic but it's that 90s nostalgia baby oh yeah catch you guys later